How's it going guys and my name is Dominic and for you guys today I'm bringing you the four attacks from my team for this YouTuber war challenge and as you can just to notice before like well before the main attack start this whole video has been played on times two speed here so just to keep this video at around a 10 minute mark because otherwise it is hitting 20 minutes long so the whole video is on times two speed I'm gonna try my best to commentate over it but we're gonna see how it goes so first attack here I've got 11 dragons trained one in the clan castle so that's 12 dragons so now I'm doing the skips this is a second town hall 9 third town hall 9 we, remember we have to attack I have to attack the fifth town hall 9 I come across this is the fourth town hall 9 so the next town hall 9 I come across that's the base so hoping it's not gonna be a hard one please it's not a hard one all right so this is the basic oh that's amazing all right so he's got three air defenses down so all I have to do now is just come from this side and yep that's pretty much gotten yeah, I can already tell this is a free star in the bank because look at that all those dragons spread out nicely on the base I did put the heroes there to try get that group of dragons to come towards the inside of a base and yes it does work well they do come towards the middle and this base is absolutely getting absolutely bum raped here the king I use a heal spell on the king just to heal him up so he doesn't lose too much health and again it works so this raid has gone perfectly I don't even know if any dragons died I can't count this at the moment but easy free start and that's free stars for our team for the first attack so that was awesome that was too easy but I have to attack the fifth town hall nine whether it's hard or easy and yep yeah. so for the next attack I'm gonna use I have to use my giant and healers I'm gonna start try cooking them up now and I'll come back to you guys when I get the troops trained so yep all the troops are trained now and I'm doing the skips again I can't remember if that first one was a Town Hall 9 so I'm not going to start counting again um, I've lost count but Giant Healers I think I took this attack strategy too literally because I just trained Giant and Healers no archers or nothing and he and Giants in the clan castle so all I have for cleanup troops are two archers and my heroes and thank god this base was so spread out because if I never had a spread out base I was gonna struggle like mad so Yep, so here we go. I got all 30 giants down. I put a few healers. I remember this strategy when I was like Town Hall 7 or 6. This was the best strategy to use. So the memories are coming back for this strategy. And I didn't know what to expect. I was lucky to get this kind of base design with like such a weak level 1 Teslas, everything. And while I was attacking this base, I was like, wait, if I don't pull off, all I have is a king and queen. And I'm attacking from the opposite side of a Town Hall. So then I put down two archers there, luckily I don't know if they're going to be able to, if everything dies off they're not going to be able to withstand, uh, well not, they're not going to be able to take out that town hall. So now 58% I've got so many giants left over, it is looking alright I think, I've got 1 minute 10 seconds left, 30% um, more needed, I think that's almost all the defences down. Um, Yep, all defences are down, so 20% needed in 50 seconds, and I think this is looking quite good. I think it's definitely on course to a 3 star. So, there you go, troops are not really spread out, but wait, 25 seconds left and 10%. Alright, this has to be done, no way. Come on. 5%, oh, it's not going to happen, no way. No, oh my gosh. Two more structures needed. The troops are right on top of those two structures, and I end up with getting a five, no, a six out of set. What's it? I end up getting five out of six stars. All right, again, my math is poor as well. All right, five out of six stars. So now we're just going to see how Raw did, and then hopefully we win this battle. All right, guys. So that's my part done for this war, and now we have Raw here. And if you're probably counting along with him and like, I don't, you couldn't hear him, but if you're counting along in the background, this is his fifth base and boy is it a tough one. He's going in with the Go Vape attack strategy, so that is with Golems, Valkyries and Peckers. And yeah, let's just see how he does. So, starts off here by placing his Golems spread out along the bottom, filter the path through for the Valkyries in the middle. And yeah, this is going really quickly, but... um. 
Alright, so now we see, okay, one Pekka's gone to the middle, the rest have shopped around the outside. I don't think that Pekka's going to do enough damage. In, uh, one Pekka itself isn't going to be enough to get a Town Hall. And, yeah, this raid looks to be on to, course to a one star here out of two. I think he was aiming for two stars. Of course, he's only going to aim for two stars with a Go Vape on this kind of base. But, ends off here with the 50% on, bare 50%. And... Only brings back one out of three stars for his first part of his war, not war attacks, his global war attacks. So second attack is so unlucky for him, he gets the Barch attack strategy, has a town or 10 up in champion. You're not going to want to have Barch, so again count along with him and let's just hope he doesn't get a hard base because it will be a real killer. So this base quite spread out. All the defense, all the spare structures that you usually have on the outside, they've been putting it inside, and this is one of the worst bases you'd want him to see. So he starts off here by, um, okay, he sort of lightning the wizard towers. Not something I'd usually do. I'd go for mortars, but let's just hope he can as well pull off a 50% because there's no way he's getting a town hall. So his his part for this war attacks was really hard here. Um, did feel sorry for him for getting like these kind of troop combinations because they're not really reliable strategies and already 28% and all his barch troops are gone all he has left is his heroes clan castle troops and just a free spell which won't be much use I don't think so he puts that free spell down quickly I didn't think I don't think he was meant to do that because it hardly did any that any effect and 33% is he gonna put down his clan castle troops We'll just see in a second. It would be a good idea with the heroes there, but nope, I don't think he does with the heroes. And 38% in 39. Is he going to give him a free shield? It's just whether he's going to give him the free shield or not. Nope. Fair play. He doesn't give him a 12 hour shield there. But as part of this <laughs> challenge, he gives a 1 out of 6 stars. It is unlucky, but what can I say? He did have the hardest troop combos. So, yeah, so. We end up, I end this battle our team Desi Dog with um, five plus what six out of twelve stars that did put us in last place. But oh well, it it was fun in general. So one last thing, thank you to all that participated. It was fun. And last but not least, got to drop my storages outside. So let's not hope I get, let's hope I don't get robbed too much. But that's it from me, guys, and peace.